This is one of the most breathtaking forts you will see in India. Spreading across the Aravalli ranges, 36 kilometers long, the Kumbhalgar Fort Wall is in the Guinness Book of World Records. But beyond the breathtaking grandeur of this fort is its strategic value and the history it made and saw through the centuries. Built on the edge of the Kingdom of Mewar, Kumbhalgar was strategically important as it protected the state from armies and invaders beyond these hills. Long before it was built, this area was also important. People often miss the fact that within the Kumbhalgar fort, there are as many as 360 temples, 300 of which are Jain temples. Some like this were large and also acted as monasteries. The origins of the Kumbhalgar fort are not very well known. It is believed to have started out as a small mud fortification from the ancient times which was rebuilt in the mid-15th century by the king who lent his name to the fort, Rana Kumbha of Mewar. He is credited to have built 32 forts in his kingdom, but this was special. It acted as an administrative centre for the region. You can even find Rana Kumbha's room here. And this was also the place where the legendary Maharana Pratap was born a hundred years later. The Kumbhalgar fort also has some famous temples. The Nilkant Mahadev temple with its high entrance and beautiful columns is a must visit, as are the Ganesh temple, probably the oldest built here, the Bhavan Devri temple and the Vedi temple which is unique as it has three stories. In Kumbhalgar, don't miss the residences of the Maharanas of Mewar or the ornate gates as you enter the fort. Set in the Aravali ranges and surrounded by forests teeming with wildlife, the Kumbhalgar fort is truly an outstanding example of strength and magnificence.